Hi, this is James with JW Freeman Plumbing, and today we'll be telling you how to uh, clear a jammed garbage disposal. Uh, a lot of times customers will call me and think that their garbage disposal is either broken um, or needs to be replaced, and many times that's not the case. And hopefully today we can save you a little bit of money on a plumbing service call. There are a few different tools that you can use. One is the self-service tool that comes with your garbage disposal. Um, the plumber that installed it may have left it underneath your sink or taped up onto the side of the cabinet. If you don't have one of these, you can use a regular quarter inch Allen wrench from your Allen wrench set. And then later on, we may need to use a pair of needle nose pliers. Now directly on the bottom of your garbage disposal should be a hole for the Allen wrench. If you put that in there, you can manually turn the motor and free it up. So this is a regular half horse garbage disposal. This is the view from the side that you would see underneath your kitchen sink. And then on the bottom, this is the hole where you would free up the motor. Just insert the Allen wrench and make sure that you can spin freely. Um, and then after that, if there is no sound at all, you probably have to reset the power to it by pressing this red button right here, that trip to the power um, to protect your motor. Now if the garbage disposal has a blockage in it that can't pass through, like glass um, or a bottle cap, that's going to have to be removed. So what you can do is get a flashlight and a pair of needle nose pliers and just take a peek inside and see if you can see what's causing the blockage, grab it and remove it. I wouldn't suggest putting your hand inside unless you just feel like having your hand devoured by a kitchen appliance. Now once you have the blockage removed and the power reset, go ahead and turn on your garbage disposal, run some water, make sure that any of the blockages that were in there are passed on through. Um, but also keep in mind in the future that plumbing systems in the kitchen aren't really designed to take food. Garbage disposals are pretty good at grinding stuff up, but the plumbing system a lot of times can't take it. So uh, if you're rinsing off a plate and a little bit of food happens to get into the sink, it's good that it gets ground up before it goes through. But you don't want to treat your garbage disposal like a trash can for food because you're going to end up causing a blockage in the future. So that's how you clear a garbage disposal. Hopefully that will save you a service call. But if you're unable to get your disposal clear and need an extra hand, uh, feel free to give us a call.